Hey guys, what's up? In this video, we'll be going over one of the most important things, how to find a winning product. In this video, I'll be going through all the criteria and I'll actually be taking you through live and showing you how to find products step by step and I'll be actually finding a winning product that I would personally test myself. So this is going to be a freebie for those who jump on this video early. On top of that, if you want to see me go through the same process three more times of three different new winning products, definitely check out the course below. It's insanely cheap and that's just one module. I'll be going through exactly what I take you through now, but I'll be doing it three more times with three more different examples and with three more different product research methods. So this is just one, but using this one method that I'm giving away for free, it's more than enough for you to succeed and find your first winning product when it comes to Google shopping. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Peace. Hey guys, so let's go over product research. I want to be able to make sure that you guys are able to find and figure out what products to test. So here's an example. Let's change the country to United States. Save. So I'm on the keyword planner where you go to tools and you click on keyword planner. Then you go to find new keywords and you'll type in say fidget spinner. You'll search and you see that there is a hundred and thirty five thousand people searching out fidget spinner. So that is pretty good. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is, oh, fidget cube. That's pretty cool. So you get fidget spinner. People are selling it for one to three dollars. And let's go on AliExpress to see how much it costs. Fidget spinner. Fidget spinners are gone for the exact same price as Google Shopping, so it's not you're not going to be able to compete. So let's try Fidget Cube maybe. Fidget Cube. Fidget cubes are gone for five, around average of eight dollars. Let's check how much it's on AliExpress for. Fidget cubes, maybe. Yep. Ooh, one dollar. One to four dollars. So again, the profit margin is a bit slim. It's not worth it. So how do you go ahead and find products? What I like to do is I like to go on Amazon best sellers and what's ever sells well on Amazon usually would sell well on Google Shopping US. So as you can see, here is everything. Um, let's start with a, you want to go into different categories. So let's start with home and kitchen, for example. You'll go down here and you'll look for products. No show socks. Let's give that a try. No show socks. Damn, twenty two thousand people every day. No show socks. Going for roughly twelve dollars, twelve, fifteen. 12 for one pair. Now let's go here. No show socks. Three dollars. One dollar. As you see, I just found you guys a winning product. And that was just because I've been doing this many, many times. So I have a gut feeling I can scroll through this and look at products that are worth searching up. But this is exactly what a product could be. There's 22,000 people searching this every day um, and like there's a $10 profit margin and like 22,000 is high that's really good so this is an example of a winning product and that's what you want to do you want to use basically um, product research methods there's a bunch on YouTube I have my own product research course um, I also give away I have this 
webinar that gives away seven product research methods. So that will be somewhere below this video. They'll have a link to that, and they'll give you seven product research methods for free. But this is just one way. And what you want to do is use those product research methods and go onto Google and see if that profit has a profit margin. And secondly, go on Keyword Plan and see if it has enough search term. But other than that, that is how you do product research when it comes to Google Shopping. Peace. Hey guys, what's up? So that was the video. I literally took you through the whole process. I gave everything away. This is something that people usually save and upsell in a course. This usually doesn't go for free on YouTube, but I'm gonna give it away for free just because I wanna provide some value. Now, if you thought that was valuable, you gotta check out the course below. It's hella cheap. It's one of the cheapest courses in the whole YouTube space when it comes to drop shipping. If you want to see me go through the same process with three more winning products, with three more different methods to find winning products, and just three more different scenarios, because you know I test several products and they don't work, and I show you live. It's a realistic walkthrough. So if you want to check that out, please check out the course below. It's insanely cheap. I don't know how long I'm going to keep the price that low because it's a steal. And on top of that, I'm, I already gave the course away for free. So. Hope you guys are enjoying this free series and you're able to go ahead and find your own winner. But other than that, if you have any questions, leave it in the comment below. If you have any questions at all, you could also slide into my DMs. If this video helped and provided you some value, give it a like and don't forget to subscribe. I'll be seeing you guys tomorrow. Peace.